rejoiced in the ways life has led them to each other and brought them to the place where they now stand. Julie and Sean, today you are pledging to be loving friends and partners in marriage, to talk and to listen, to trust and appreciate one another, to respect and cherish each other, and to support, comfort, and love one another through life's joys and sorrows. The two of you have already begun to build your home together. May your home be forever filled with peace, happiness, and compassion for others. And may your lives be forever intertwined, your love keeping you together, come what may. Remember that love is patient, love is kind, it is not jealous or boastful. Love is not rude or arrogant, it does not insist on its own way. Love is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrongdoing, but rejoices in truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never dies. Now, Julie and Sean, please face each other and join hands so that you may feel the gift that you are to one another. These are the hands of your best friend, young, strong, and full of love. And as you promise to love each other all the days of your lives, these hands will work alongside yours as you build your future. These hands will faithfully love you and your children and cherish you through the years. These hands will hold you when fear and grief surround you and comfort you in illness. These hands will give you strength when you need it and join with yours in happy times. These hands, even when wrinkled and aged, will remain a source of joy, comfort, and love. Now look at one another and remember this moment in time. Before this moment, you've been many things to one another, acquaintance, friend, companion, and teacher. And now you will say a few words that will take you across a threshold of life, and things will never quite be the same between you. For after these vows, you will say to the world, this is my husband, and this is my wife. Sean and Julie have chosen to recite their own vows. Jules, you are my favorite person, the love of my life, and my best friend. I will always be true to you. You can count on me to keep your animal addiction in check. I will always consider your thoughts and your feelings. Solid as they come, I will support you and love you in all that you do. Jules, we make an amazing team. I look forward to growing old with you. The best is yet to come. I love you so much. of unity 
a circle unbroken without beginning or end. And today, Julie and Sean give and receive these rings as demonstrations of their vows to make their lives one, to work at all times to create a life that is whole and unbroken, and to love each other without end. Sean, please repeat after me as you take this ring and do it. I, Sean, give you, Julie, this ring. Wear it with love and joy. As this ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. I choose you to be my wife this day and every day. Today, we have gathered friends and family to celebrate the love and union of Julie and Sean. They have gathered each of you here to be a part of this ceremony as they make a lifelong commitment to one another. Julie and Sean, today you are here to join both of your lives together. These two separate vases of sand symbolize your separate lives before today. They symbolize your separate friends, your separate families, and your separate choices. Today, both of you will seal your bond by blending these two individual vases together. Once the sand is blended together, it cannot be separated. Just as the sand cannot be separated, your friends and family are here today to witness your love never separating. By blending these sands together, we are recognizing the importance of blending two families together. May you always honor and protect your family. May this be the first of your dreams come true and of a hope that will always be there. May this be the start of a lifetime of trust and of caring that's just now begun. And may today be a day you'll always remember, the day when your hearts became one. Your vows may have been spoken in minutes, but your promises to each other will last a lifetime. And as you've pledged yourselves before this community of friends and family and by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.